Students in Vancouver are walking out today to support a student who chose to speak out about claims of bullying and sexual assault at school. Charles Chandler says school officials are blocking him from walking at graduation because of his comments. Jennifer Dowling is live in Vancouver with the details. Jennifer. Good afternoon. There are more than 100 students that have taken part in this walkout in support of Charles Chandler. You can see them in front of Heritage High School right there holding signs and standing out in support. We also have some parents that have joined here as well on the sidewalk holding signs, supporting his message, supporting the students have been, that may have been victims of bullying. Now, Charles Chandler said school leaders are blocking him from walking at graduation after he talked about the issues during a high school assembly earlier this week. Charles says students have told him stories of being bullied and even groped at Heritage High School. He says those students have felt like they haven't been heard by school leaders and the situation there hasn't improved. However, he says the school district didn't want to hear it, saying he deviated from his approved comments at the assembly and Charles feels the school is now punishing him for bringing to light a serious problem. I want people to understand that, you know, this is wrong and that um, the, these victims, they, they need help. And that they need to not be afraid to, to have someone to talk to, and they need to not be afraid to voice their opinion. The school issued a statement saying his comments had many inaccuracies, inflammatory statements, and unsubstantiated accusations. They say they met with him discussing several options for a restorative resolution, or as a final option, if the student didn't want to work towards a resolution, disciplinary options would be undertaken. And Charles says that is the case. He is not being allowed to walk at his graduation on June 8th. That is coming up very quickly. Now, the protest against the school's decision has also picked up steam on social media with the hashtag Let Charles Walk. I just spoke with Charles uh, right before uh, we went live here at noon. He tells me that he is heartened by the show of support from students and some adults that have come out here to support him as well and his right to speak out. He says that he wants his message to be not one of bashing the school administration or staff members, but one that uh, this situation needs to be addressed. Bullying and sexual harassment needs to be addressed in the school. And some parents echoed that as well, uh, saying that they felt maybe that policies needed to change to uh, better address the students needs and we'll have an update on the walkout coming up tonight at four five and six as well back to you Jenny yeah that's quite a turnout there okay thank you Jennifer